Hi guys, welcome to Cheryl's Home Cooking. I was at the grocery store and I happened to see this new product that McCormick is putting out. And it's via Instapot. So I figured I'd give it a try. It's called the Mississippi Roast. So I took a roast out of the freezer. And I'll make it according to the directions on the back of this package. So you'll need, obviously, this one package of Instapot from McCormick, a roast, one cup of water, half a stick of butter, and seven pepperoncinis. So I'll let you know how it turns out. And I figured this would be quick and easy in the Instapot. The Instapot that I'm using is the one that the Easter Brothers of St. Louis sent me. So I can't wait to try this out and see what it tastes like. So let's get started. The directions are telling me to add water to the pot. So I have one cup of water. Then I'll place the roast inside this pot. So I place the roast in the pot. It said to cut the roast in half. So now I'll open up the package. And this roast is about two and a half pounds. So now I'll sprinkle the seasoning mix on top. Now I'll place a half a stick of butter on top and seven pepperoncinis. So in my pot I have one cup of water a half a stick of butter, two and a half pounds of roast that I cut in half. Now I'll put in the seasoning mix on top. Now I'll place seven pepperoncinis on top. I'll put my lid on and then I'll set the setting to meat and stew. And this is the McCormick Instapot Mississippi Roast that I'm trying. So now I have my lid on. I have it set to meat and stew. I'll press the start button. And this Instapot is the one that the Easter Brothers of St. Louis sent me. I love using it. So thankful I have it. I took the roast out of the Instapot. I'll let it cool in this pan. Once it's cooled, I'll shred it up and then I'll put it on a roll and this is what we'll be having for dinner. I let my meat cool and then I shredded it all up. So it's in the juice. You can serve this over rice, mashed potatoes, but I'm gonna serve it on a sub roll looks good smells good now doesn't this look delicious and this is what it looks like I'll put a little juice in a bowl off to the side and you can either dip it in the juice or just eat it as is it really smells good well thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next video bye bye